Welcome back to the Don and Gino Real Estate and Finance Show right here on your hometown station, AM 1220 KHDS. And remember, our goal is always to guide you to personal and financial wealth. Well, thank you for joining the second half of the Don and Gino Real Estate and Finance Show on our New Year's special. We're looking forward to our New Year's. And we're very excited about 2018. In fact, we were kind of giving you an idea of what happened in 2017 and kind of giving you an idea of what we feel is going to happen in 18. So we should finish it up because Gina was mentioning about reverse mortgages. But first, we'd love you to join us and see our goofy outfits and everything um, preparing for the New Year's by going to donandgino.com. I know he took off his fun hat. Right, donandgino.com. Click on the live stream button. And voila. Also, you'll see all our videos, over 1,800 videos from our shows for the last seven years, plus the National Real Estate Cafe for two, over two and a half years. We've been doing a daily video blog that gives you updates on what's really happening in the real estate and financial markets on a daily basis without any political spins or agendas. It's just great information. Again, donandgino.com. But wait, there's more. <laughs> you can also hit the National Real Estate Cafe tab there and go to our podcast. So we're oh, yeah. also our podcast is available on iTunes. I know podcasts are super popular these days. I can't get into it personally. I just don't have enough listening time. Uh, but it'd be fantastic if you joined our podcast. I guarantee it's valuable information with great professionals, the best professional we find. So that t that kind of tease, uh, teases up for this next segment. So New Year's is a perfect time for all of us. All of us. You know, do a little retroflecting on what happened in 17 and what we wanted mm -hmm. to do. We, let's see, in 17, I'm going to do this. And at the end of the year, you go, hmm, did I do all that I was going to do? Did I lose the weight I thought I was going to lose? Did I start that business I thought I was going to do? Did my kids do that? Blah, 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 blah. And you're like, eh, not all of it. Well, hopefully you hit some of those marks. I hope so. Right? And, and that's the other thing too, right? If you set this long list of goals of 10 items and you hit two or three, congratulations. Good job. Or you got halfway there. Yeah. Maybe you said you're going to lose 100 pounds and you lost 50. Excellent. Great. Great direction. Actually, that's better probably. Yeah. Because you lose 100, you probably put the 100 back on. And I'm going to go one step further, and I'm going to say if you tried some of those things and failed, good job. You tried. You at least had it on your goals list. Put it back on there again this year and try harder. Do it again. Yeah, maybe you'll get instead of three months in, you get six months in. Now you're like, oh, I'm halfway there, and then it gets you over the edge. So yeah, or maybe you have some unfinished projects. Now maybe the you know things are less busy these next couple of weeks. Mm -hmm. Try to knock those out. I know I told you I'm cleaning up loose ends right now. Just yep. boom, 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 cleaning up any little loose ends to make sure I started off 2018 clean. Okay, so if you've listened to our show at all, we hope you do, and you share it with your friends, uh, that you'll know that our goal is to guide you to personal financial. That's been our goal since the beginning of our show. So we've gotten better at that. We've done that by interviewing all these great people and find out who's really great at their craft. Plus, it has educated us about what's really important to know. Because we actually, there's a lot we didn't know until these professionals came on when we had our trust attorney, Lisa Odom, come on, for example, and start talking about trust and the value of trust and what, what a trust does and what's involved in a trust. You're like, oh, shoot. The pitfalls if you don't have one, and, oh. you know, uh, probate court and uh, all kinds of problems that can happen, uh, even if we talked about advanced medical directives. Yeah. Right? If you have an 18-year-old child, you can't make decisions for them. They're an adult, and you can't help them if they had an accident near the hospital. Uh, just so many things. So we became uh, dangerous enough in the trust world to know enough about it to say, hey, it sounds like you need to talk to Lisa. Right. And, and so that's Well, something. these are the people that we use. We're going to give you specific examples. For example, both of us went and sat down with Lisa to do our trust finally, which is sad. It should have been done since, <laughs> should, since you're 18. Should, yeah. You should have started a trust. But basically, then when he sat down, once she started going through the questions of the trust, it was like, oh, my gosh. Never thought about that. Didn't think about that. Didn't know that was important. Shoot, I don't know what would have happened if I didn't put that in my trust. It's, it's super, super important. important. Yeah. And then you have to remember you have trust maintenance. So – all kinds of great things that came from just one of our professionals. Trust us. <laughs> Sorry, couldn't help it. All right. Still, we're still Mr. Pun. Yeah. So, okay. So we put together this group. So we have bankruptcy attorney. We have a divorce attorney. We have uh, insurance planner, college planner, financial planner, trust attorney, as we mentioned. You name it, we have it. And we're talking the guns. We're, these are the best of the best of Santa Clarita. All have decades of experience and they're accountable they're not just accountable to you but they've been accountable to us meaning these are all the professionals we use we know they're rock stars we know they care they ask the right questions and they guide us which is imperative not just hey here's a quote it's 
hey, let's double check that you have, oh, perfect example. Were there any fires recently? Hmm. Did anybody go to Just their insurance? Bit. And they went to their insurance and they're like, I have insurance, yay. And they go, yeah, you can build half your house or three quarters of your house because you were underinsured because your insurance carrier didn't double check that you were insured properly. Or a small tip that we learned on one of our shows. The, the day that I evacuated my house in the most recent fire, I ran around my house with my phone and I took pictures and I took video and I made sure to take pictures of all the TVs and everything that I had in my home so that if the insurance company says, oh, no, you didn't have that, I said, yes, I did. Sure you had 120 bottles of wine. <laughs> <laughs> uh, maybe I do. Yeah. Maybe I don't. So if you ever I can't want, confirm or deny. If you ever want to send gifts, send wine. We'll, it always works for us. All right. So basically, we put together this group, and we'd love to share them with you. And you should put your if you don't have them, or you have holes in your life group. These are the people that affect your life. You can utilize ours by going to aprgi.com. That's aprgi.com, as in America's Professional Resource Group Inc. It's an amazing group, a lot of great information there. And I'm telling you, all these professionals have helped us and a ton of our clients and friends. And I can't tell you how good it feels to know that you have your life insurance in place, to know that your property and casualty insurance is the best mm -hmm. it could ever be. We both have earthquake insurance now, which we didn't yep. have when we, we started have the year. insurance on each other. That's you right. Have a business or a partnership. What if your partner goes down? Then what? Mm -hmm. Do you want to be – first of all, you need to, to employ somebody to replace them for the work that they do. And secondly, do you want to become their partner? Or their spouse's partner? Yeah, these Ooh. are the things you got to think about. So, again, aprgi.com. These are the people you have to think of when you're putting together your household for 2018. Because a lot of us like a fresh start. These are the things you should think about. Here's one we haven't talked about on the show yet, but we'll start the year off by trying to get somebody in to talk about this. But with tax reform, should you incorporate? Ooh, that's good stuff. All right. So <laughs> stay tuned. Uh, we have another segment of really good stuff. And... We also have good friends of ours. We have Mr. Kevin Brutstrup. He is actually our pipeline manager right here at Skyline Home Loan. Does a rock star job. Becky, one of our top processors that makes the home uh, process so smooth. That's why she's a good processor. And then we have one of our top mortgage planners, Tony Valdez, and his teammate, Christina Senda, coming up to share some New Year's love with you. And stay tuned for the next segment. Looking forward to a wonderful 2018. I think um, with our new office, we're poised to really take over and get a lot of the market in the Santa Cruz Valley at Skyline. Um, hoping to uh, add at least 40% to our last year's production, which was wonderful. I'm looking to add some great sales teams and hopefully get some more people in here. Um, personally, 2018, I think it's going to be a very exciting year for me. I'm excited by a big family trip that we have to Cabo in June. Um, we're looking at potentially buying a new house this summer. So I think it's going to be a really good and exciting 2018, and I'm very, very excited about it. Becky? We can't top that. <laughs> I, too, am excited about 2018 and uh, to be a part of such a wonderful growing organization. Um, um, we, ha we are doing so much for the area and the real estate market, for and sure. um, I look to be, uh, be a part of that. And, uh, yeah. I can't even think. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's all right. Have a wonderful, happy new year, everybody. Hey, guys. Tony Valdez here. And I'm Christina Senda. We wanted to wish all of you a prosperous and healthy 2018. Feliz Año Nuevo. <laughs> happy New Year.